So if I click on conferences, and I'm sure right now everyone is getting this sort of notice, so that um, conferences by default in Canvas are run through a tool called Big Blue Button. And um, so if your institution is not using some other um, conferencing uh, app, then the Big Blue Button is a free app. Um, but as you can see, there is a note here that due to this sort of big uptick in uh, classes going online and a lot of instructors um, either by choice or, or being required to have synchronous learning sessions and using web conferencing to do so, um, you know, that can have an effect on um, the quality of connection, um, and speeds and things like this. So not only for you as the instructor, but also for the students. So that's something to be mindful of, is that there still may be connectivity issues and that sort of thing, simply because there are it's, there's so many users at one time. All right, so um, I could name this conference, and I, you know, Sandbox Conference is mainly because that's the the sort of course that I'm in, right? My little sandbox area. Uh, I am using the big blue button. Now you may end up having through your institution some other kind of conferencing session, but uh, here we're just using the default big blue button. Uh, the duration, you can change that duration, shorter, longer, and if it is for your class time, then you might just want to have it for that duration as well. Uh, you can enable recording. I do recommend doing that no matter what the the web conferencing is uh, simply because, again, your students may end up getting um, suddenly disconnected and missing part of it. They might not be able to get connected at all. And so if you at least have a recording that you then make available to them, they can review the material that they you know, missed during that, sex, that session. Um, but also, as an instructor, I find it helpful to have something to go back and reflect upon uh, with a session to see you know what worked what didn't because at the time especially in a maybe kind of a new environment for you um, teaching online is you may not have ever had a chance to um, have a look at, at how those things are going for you all right you can have it with no time limit um, so if you do know that you're gonna have a long uh, conference this may or may not be necessary for like a class time, um, but you know if you were just going to have sort of like an open come and go sort of free time, maybe maybe like a as far as conference, maybe like an office hours, extended office hours or something like this, that might be something to keep you know to, to think about doing. Um, we can have a description, and so that might help also with um, you know if you don't have uh, maybe a really specific name for that conference session, uh, then you might want to just give a description. So to invite all course members, I'll update that. And this way, when somebody comes in, they'll know which one that they were going into if you had multiple um, conferencing sessions set up. 